Chuka New Zealand approached us because they had a gap in their project team. Previously they had they performed all projects in house with their in-house design team, but they'd either moved on or been promoted. So they had a gap there and they came to us because we were certified for NZS 4024, which is the machine safety standard. They had a big project coming up where they were going to move the production line about five to ten metres from the point where it is north and they were going to introduce a new machine. They wanted to upgrade all their machines for compliance, the latest safety standards. Well, our machines are probably 30 years old across our four sites. With the new WorkSafe law changes, we had to make them safe for the guys. We said, yeah, we can do that. We came and had a meeting with the senior team about production and how the machines worked. And we identified that there was actually two parts to this project. There was The first part was to upgrade the machines for machine safety, and the other thing was to keep production up and running at all times. Now, to do that, we had to design and build a, a new MCC that wasn't previously there, so we could keep the conveyor belts running. So if they were doing a saw blade change on one of the machines, they could keep the other machine running. That was quite critical. We then went to a machine risk assessment on all the machines. We performed a machine risk assessment for five machines there and came up with safety requirements specification for the entire project. We then went into detail design phase where we did the electrical schematic designs, we did the PLC programming, we designed a HMI, we gave them cable schedules, they had their own in-house team that, that installed everything, and we came out there and then commissioned it and validated it for compliance. I'd recommend them, they'll be doing more work here um, as it comes up and possibly some of, some of our other sites.